Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I am going to show you how to add a 3D model on your WordPress website, just like this one. It looks amazing, right? And the best part, you can add a 3D model like this in just a few minutes, even if you are not a developer. Alright, let's get started. First, go to your WordPress dashboard. Now go to the plugins and add a new plugin. In a search bar, type 3D Viewer. So install the first plugin called 3D Viewer and click Activate. Once it's activated, you will see a new tab in your dashboard. Click on 3D Viewer and add a new. Now give your 3D Viewer a name. It can be like anything. Scroll down and you will see the default settings. These are already great, but you can tweak them based on your needs. Here's also option of adding a new 3D model. So now let's add our 3D model. To do that, go to Sketchfab. This is my favorite place to find high quality 3D models. In the search bar, type what kind of model you are looking for. Like I just write car. Here's a lot of options. Click on any model you like. I just click this. You can see how the model will look. Scroll down and you will see a download button. So if you don't see the download option or if you click and it's not downloading, it's probably because you are not logged in. So make sure to create an account and login first. Now click download and choose the .glb format. This is what we will use in the plugin. Once downloaded, go back to your WordPress dashboard and upload the .glb file in the source file section of the 3D viewer plugin. Click save. At the top, you will see a shortcode. Just copy that. Now we can embed this shortcode on a page. You can either add it on an existing page or create a new one. I am going to create a new page and name it something like a car. Click edit with Elementor. Search for the shortcode widget. Drag it to your sections and paste the shortcode you copied earlier. Click publish and view the page. And here your 3D model is now live on your website and fully interactive. You can rotate it, zoom in and it works great on both desktop and mobile. And that's it. Super easy, right? If you found this helpful, please like, subscribe and hit the bell icon so you can never miss any cool tips from Web Wizardry. Let me know in the comment what kind of 3D model you plan to add. Thanks for watching and I will see you in the next video.